Hey YouTubers, I wanted to do a couple of analogies for you. I've been watching a lot of videos, people not wanting to register their drones, getting rid of their drones because they have to be registered, and things like that. And I'll be the first to admit I've seen several places where people have been watching YouTube and penalizing and going after drone pots that have done something that was improper or illegal. But I, I want to draw a couple of analogies. First one, back in the early 1900s, late 1800s, when automobiles first came online, people were doing anything they wanted with them. Regulation had to step in eventually. That's why we have motor vehicle codes. That's why driving a car is a privilege. It's not a right. Well, I have a feeling that flying a drone is a right. Okay? And making money with it is a privilege. But there are rules. We have to follow those rules. Uh, if we don't follow them, we do get penalized. Laws are out there to protect everybody from things. I'm going to put a couple of pictures up in this video. Uh, recent incident with a Nanafi in a French territory. Very close to an A380. Passenger plane that carries 500 people. Now, very similar to the way people say motorcycles give motorcycles a bad name. It's not every motorcycle, it's just certain ones. They drive recklessly, they drive without paying any attention to the rules, and vehicle drivers of cars get upset at them, gives them a bad name. Well, this person that flew this Sanafi close to that A380 gives drone pilots a bad name. I was very glad to see it didn't cause any harm, get hurt the aircraft, and it could. As Ken Heron has post, uh, pointed out, it's a bad thing. It gives us a bad name as drone pilots. I think it needs to stop. Uh, I've registered my drones and I'm working on taking the part 107 test. I just can't get the time to take it. Uh, I've taken the pre-tests and it, it should go pretty well when I do finally take it. But my drones are registered and I do fly them within the law, within the regulations, within the rules that have been set forward. Uh, I don't think registration is necessarily a bad thing. You have to register your car. Driving is a privilege. Maybe flying a drone needs to be a privilege. You do need to register it. Anyway, that's my two cents for whatever it's worth. Uh, I really do wish that some of these people wouldn't stop flying drones just because they have to be registered. You don't stop driving a car because you got to register it. And it's pretty much the same thing. People did some stupid stuff. Rules had to be implemented. Those rules have to be followed. And that's my two cents for whatever it's worth. Uh, take it or leave it. It doesn't bother me one way or the other, but I'm not going to give up my privilege to fly drones because I really enjoy it. It's as close to flying as I'll ever get again. Uh, so this retired pilot just pretty much enjoys seeing the world from that view. So I'll follow the rules, I'll register, and hopefully I'll get my Part 107 here in a couple of weeks. I just got to find the time to go over to the local testing center and take the test. So y'all take care, drone safely, and have a happy day. Adiós.